everybody, welcome to uh, Britpop's Hello. React. It's Tuesday, we are three days into the World Cup 2022 in Qatar. Yep. And we've had, a, well, a bit of an interesting one, haven't we, so far? Yeah, I mean, uh, keeping the interest going, aren't they? Um, yeah, yeah, a couple yeah. Of, couple of decent scores, a couple of upsets. Um but we're gonna we're gonna start at day one. Uh just yeah. do a quick recap of the opening so ceremony because what we got for you today, yeah, we've got a bit of the opening ceremony. Uh yeah. we've got England's uh, goals against Iran. We're gonna look at Wales as well with their draw against the US. Uh and also Saudi today. Arabia and Argentina <laughs> today. A bit Who of an upset thought? there. Hey, we won't we're spoil it. That one out. No. But um if you're new to the channel, uh, wonder what us two idiots are doing. Uh, we normally do reactions to other things, but because it's a World Cup, we're going to try and do a daily-ish update. Yeah, every couple on... of days about what's going on. Uh, keep you up to date. Keep us sane. Uh, News and views. Anything funny that comes out of it or anything that we may have picked up along the way, uh, we'll yeah. try and pass it along. But um, let's go back to day one. I mean, they had how long? 12 years to... Uh, to organize this opening yeah, ceremony. Yeah, 12 years, yeah. And, and to get people to in the stadium as well, which yeah. they've that, already that had trouble helps. with. Mm -hmm. All um, right. So eventually, I think it was a 30 minute spectacle, and Morgan Freeman and some camels turned up. So. Oh, lovely. We'll talk. Over to the... We're not going to have any uh, audio purposes because obviously for copyright and stuff, so we'll Ooh, yes. just chat through. Get hammered. All right, here we go. Get hammered. Um, a bit Morgan Freeman there. I mean, what's going on there? Oh, he's I'm, actually I'm... there. He, yeah, yeah so he was talking to uh I'll Laid on the floor. Some, yep so Hello. it's morgan freeman and janim al muftar um, oh whoever i'll find out who janin al muftar is um so yeah a bit of a strange sort of combination so there morgan obviously freeman. disability there yes uh He's a Qatari YouTuber and philanthropist with caudal regression syndrome. Right. Okay, it's so a bit of traditional yeah. dancing, I guess, here. All right. Okay. I mean, it, you know, they, they like we've seen with a lot Do of things. Do we need all of it? You know oh, what I, I mean? Know. It's a World Cup yeah. at the end of the day. It's, it's not like Olympics or anything like that, but... There was, uh, there was talk that they were going to do an, an opening ceremony to every single game, weren't they? And then that got scrapped at the last Why? minute. What's the point? We just we're there for football, right? Yeah, we're I mean, I'm football. not quite sure what all this has got to do with it. I mean, uh, but yeah, that that was uh, up until pretty much the day before. Um, all the rehearsals had taken place for an opening ceremony to every single game, and then of course we had the shock two days before didn't we that the 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 beer wasn't going to be on sale yeah yeah no alcohol so, um, oh here we no go some of the old uh, the old uh, okay france mascots yeah, Japan. yeah mascots um so obviously that upset budweiser what's going on there they must have spaced ghost? Uh, interesting like casper the old ghost there Ooh. ghost of football past um and I believe, uh, yeah, is this, you got BTS's uh, Jungkook, he's sung. Oh, BTS was there, right, okay. From BTS, yeah. Well, only Jungkook, yeah, he's sung, he sung the official um, World Cup anthem. Um, so... That's a good job we haven't got BTS. the audio, otherwise we'd be absolutely hammered. Yeah, <laughs> that, that would have been finished straight away. But yeah, that is um, uh, Jungkook. Jungkook from a BTS, who we have done on the channel in the past. Now and yeah, again. yeah, we've done quite a bit of BTS. Um, so, although beer was banned, they were selling the uh, Budweiser Zero. Right, okay. Um, and uh, you've got all these sort of fan zone places. Apparently, they haven't quite taken off because the atmosphere, you know, people get together, go there for the drinks. Yeah, look at that. That's quite impressive. It looks like a big that cake. That look a birthday does, yeah. cake. That does look impressive. Pull your candles out. That's um, it. That uh, was it. Didn't see, didn't, didn't see the army on camels. Apparently, they, uh, they had the army on camels as well. So um, Really? All right. Not quite all sure right. about the opening ceremony side of things. Well, but, opening um, ceremonies, I mean, I, I, you know, for me, they're, they're all right. I prefer okay. them at, World, uh, at Olympics because it has yeah. a bit more meaning. But as a World Cup, it's just like... Let's just get on with the football. Just get on. They're trying and to make talking it... of getting on with the football, it did. It went straight into the opening game. Did, Qatar yeah. v. Um, Ecuador. And what was the score there? Wasn't 2 0 Ecuador, wasn't it? Yeah. yeah. 
I tried. Problem is, problem is, like you say, normally you want the host countries, the host nations to do well because then, you know, it gets local support going, people get involved, and you know, so yeah, let's see how they get on. But um, they're not, they're not a strong side. But um, no. on to day two. So yeah, day, day two, two we England. had yeah England for England. us two lads, both from England. One o'clock kick off. Um, yeah, one o'clock in the afternoon. Played around. I think we all expected to to win the game. Um, yeah, six two, mate. In the end, six two. Yeah, I mean, but let's be honest. Let's me and him were watching it together. Um, we said we we keep dicking about in defence. Oh, we Our do. Defense, let's watch it. I mean, every time, isn't start. it? Here I we mean, go. So talk us through this. Uh, well, it's a good goal. Good ball from uh, Shaw. Lovely header from yeah. Bellingham, wasn't it? Yeah, um, first English that, goal. First English goal. Yeah, uh, just prior to that, I think um, Maguire had a chance, didn't he? At Did the, he at the, the bar? Spot. Yeah, yeah. These are the goals. Good knockdown from Maguire. That was yeah. That was a tasty instinct, one there. wasn't it? From uh, he had to come back on himself, old Saka. So, yeah. Great finish. Good. Yeah, he's having a good tournament already. You know, young lads. I mean, they're all young lads out there, which is cool. Yeah. That was a nice one. That yeah, that was Kane, impressive, wasn't it? Kane across. Kane the again. Delivering, he, I mean, he delivered. He, he gave he did, some good deliveries, yeah. and he got nothing all day. Saka that, put the fourth in. Good dummies, yeah. cut the dummies there. Made it. That's sort of a messy got messy goal. Sort of game, a goal that Messi would have scored, wasn't it? Keeps it along the deck, and then this. <laughs> this was, this was brilliant. Literally. Inspired substitution. He'd only been on the pitch for three minutes. Yeah, something like that. Again, good ball releasing Wilson, wasn't it? And yeah, then unselfishly pulled it back for Grealish. I mean, by then, yeah. By then, I think you know the um, Iran had sort of the heads started dropping. They they made three substitutions straight after half time. Um, yeah, I'm not sure of that. It's not yeah. quite the old crouchy robot, but uh, yeah, fair play not, to not him. Yeah, not sure on that. Agree this. Well, th- what we Didn't haven't got show there. the Iran goes. Yeah, I no, mean there was a. Yeah, I mean you talk it. Yeah, so basically, it's just the the, the, the highlight we got here. But you know, Iran's goals again, are just. Bad defending, wasn't it? Um, Bad defending. I mean, the, know, to be fair, the, the 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 goal that he scored was a good goal. He, the, 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 oh yeah, he the guy to do quite a lot. Yeah, and then there was a penalty, penalty about two seconds before the final whistle, which again was a bit dubious. Went to VAR. I mean, Maguire had a good shout for a, a penalty in the, right in the opening minutes, didn't he? Well, he was literally bear hugged Rattled. to the floor. I mean, it's yeah. again inconsistency with VAR. What consist? Yeah. You know, pulling of the shirt. All right, I can see. Yeah, he's pulled his shirt. He's gone down. You could argue it is the penalty. Yeah. But when you're hugging someone and you've literally huh. wrestled to the floor, which is what's what the happened difference? With in the first couple of minutes, and you know, if the ref had done that, then it would have set a precedence for the for the rest of the match. No, no, no more messing about in the um, in the area. But it, yeah, huh. it was a bit strange. I mean. And then when we had the goalie, didn't we? We had the old—I um, don't know—we if haven't got any footage of that. The, so within the no. first few minutes, the um, Iranian goalkeeper clashed heads with with one of his players, uh, and like, I mean, it looked like it had broken. It took forever for them to sub oh, him off. Oh, it was about over ten minutes. Ridiculous. Yeah, so Forty minutes, wasn't it? In the end. It, all in all, I think we had an extra twenty-four minutes, didn't we? Of the yeah, game. Yeah, with, the I game. think there was ten ten minutes in the second half, forty minutes in the first half. Uh, Maguire got taken off as well for a suspected concussion, so I think he'll be out of the next game as well. Um, mm. So, some, some positives, but again, I mean... Well, 6-2 uh, the, win. 6-2, yes, top of the group. South, Southgate did come out and say when they play slower, which is what was happening, wasn't it? it yeah. They're not as good. They need to be sort of on, you know... You know and they've um, got to tie it up a bit for the defence, otherwise we're not... You know, you, you, you look at your Germans... Your Brazilians. Yeah. When, when them come, yeah, yeah. You know, if you're playing them, you're French. You know, Mbappe against Maguire or Dyer, oh. you know. Leave them standing. You, you game over, innit? Game over. Yep. Even yeah. the dog agrees Even on that one. Even the dog agrees with that one. Absolutely. Yep. All right, moving on. I haven't yep. seen anything else. So I haven't seen the Wales drawing 1 1 with USA uh, mm. last night. So um, we'll watch a bit of that, shall we? Yeah, Gareth I, Bale. Who yeah. else have they got? Uh, Wales. Well, I got a uh, Pompey player, Joe Morrell. I think he came on the second half. Here we okay. go. So USA apparently were nice quite ball. dominant early on. That's a nice. Oh, nearly an own goal there. Well, we got yeah, some highlights that... of this game, that rather than the help. goals. Okay. Quite speedy, isn't he? Isn't he? Round the 
round the back. Oh, cut the dirty chances. Unlucky, unlucky, mate. He took that ball down well. Yeah, I mean, that was something we were saying yesterday. England first touch appalling. Yeah, it was, wasn't it? And many awful. players oh, just touched oh, off the post. That was unfortunate. Nicely done. I mean, you know. Look at the pace, though. The, the, the desire here. Look at that. Look at that. Oh, that's a great Ooh, goal. Oh, what a goal. Very good goal, yeah. Who's that? Georgie Ware? It's not. It's, I think it's brother. Timothy Ware, yeah. All oh, right, okay. George not Ware much. was the 90s. <laughs> They'd have to wheel him out if it was in. <laughs> good finish there, but straight under the keeper. Good finish. And the thing is, you know, I mean, soccer in the US now, getting massive, isn't it? You know, it is getting big, yeah. You know, before we, you're, you're playing in the USA, it's not their main game, but now kids are starting from an early age. They're going to be a massive force. Oh, and, oh unlucky. See, there's a, what I love about Wales is the togetherness. They've got, look at, I mean, yeah. just look at the fans behind the goal there. You know, they're all yeah. in the shirt. There's all in the shirts. They all have the passion together. bucket hats on, didn't they? Yeah, they really, you know, they really do follow well. And the that team is a team as well. They really stick together. Oh, oh, yeah, that was a pen. Okay. Oh, That's interesting. Yeah. Oh, oh, yeah, he's come through. Oh, he's yeah, come through the back of it. the back. Yeah, that's yeah, definitely not... penalty. And there he is. <laughs> there he is. Come on. Blow it out. Now, did he smash it or place it? I'm going for smash. Mm, I'm going for place. Yeah. Put your foot through it, son. Yeah. Good goal. Uh, where's he at nowadays? Well, he's plays in the US. Now. He plays for. Um, oh, he's out there. Los Angeles, the, um, yeah. Yes, LA Galaxy, isn't it? No, not LA Galaxy. It's it's the, Miami. No, no, no. Los Angeles. Yeah, I can't remember what their full name is. Like a four acronym for. Oh, did okay. Wales have a chance to win this? That is a good. Oh, break. not Ooh. really. Yeah, poor shot. Poor shot. Had a chance. Uh, let me just check on that. Yeah, one one. One one one. That was a good result for Wales, I think, in 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 the US. Because, like you said, the US have really come on. You know, and as time progresses, the more that they get involved into the sport, yeah. You know, just the amount of people that they have in the US, you've got a better selection pool than probably anywhere else. So, I think as time goes on, the US are going to get better and better and better. But it was a good I result. Think so. um, one one. It's good for England as well in the league. You know. And, yeah, in in their uh, in their group. So that's um, you know uh, one win and. Um, to a draw there for those guys, yeah. So you were you were right there, mate. Los Angeles FC, LAFC, as they're known, yeah. Yeah. Uh, is bail. And then today, day oh, three, what's earlier, going on? Well, yeah, earlier today. in the day. Um, so uh, Argentina v Saudi Arabia. I mean, on paper, down. mate, this is a straightforward win, isn't it? For it's, well, a, six, it it's a six nil job, isn't it? Should have been. Yeah, oh, well, it should well. I don't know. I don't know too much about Saudis, but let's let's, let's uh, kick it off. Okay. Oh. So obviously. So they, there was a pull Argentina, there. Argentina. Right. No got... different. No different to Maguire yesterday, no. where we didn't get a penalty. Let's see. Oh, that was nothing. Oh, oh, really oh it's even. Back. It's less than a penalty than Maguire. Yeah. Straight away, VAR, and he gives it pen. now. Straight okay. away, there's no incons there's no consistency there. No, you know, here he is hard. the world famous uh, Lionel Messi plays uh, for Barcelona. Yeah. No, Best he doesn't. In the world. Plays for PSG. <laughs> PSG now, sorry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Brilliant. I was behind. It, I mean, for me, I've watched a lot of Messi. Look at that. You know, he is one of the world's <laughs> greatest players. <laughs> Classy play. Right, so Argentina actually went 1 0 up, didn't realise yeah, that. Yeah, 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 they were 1 0 up. Bad defending, yeah. none. Oh, dearie Ooh. me, good finish. Okay, good goal. I mean, they, you know, they cannot dispute that. He, he played that well. Played him in, turned it, scored. It wasn't a, you know, a ricochet off somebody else or something, you know. He still had a lot to do there. He hit it down into the ground. I mean, it's. Yeah, yeah. A good finish, but again, across the keeper, back the way it came. Disappointing from um, yeah, Argentine. You know the defence. Uh, they should be getting rid of that ball. I mean, generally, you know, Argentina defenders are normally spot on. 
Then what else we got here? Okay. Fair All right. He's, he's speedy, isn't he? Fair. Kept it oh, in. Oh, poor clearance again. Really poor. Oh. Again, not getting rid of it. Not attacking the ball. Nice turn. Down. He should have taken nice him away shimmy. there. Oh. No. Oh. That's a great goal. <laughs> All right. Goal. Great that finish. That is a good goal. Definitely. Uh, oh. Oh, I tell that. you what. Um, prior to this, Argentina had not lost for thirty-six games. Right. So it just shows you what they just bottle it at the World Cup. I swear they've got something at the World Cup where they just bottle it, and certainly in the last twenty years, because you know they've had real difficulties against you know Eastern and African teams remember how they Nigeria are uh, a bit of a, a thorn in the yeah. side for them aren't they yeah 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 um, now there's another horrific in injury I heard uh, we haven't got it there but um, I believe there was another bad injury in that game where the Saudi Arabia goalkeeper come out and again on one of his own players need him in the face so um, I don't know we haven't really got that one but uh, apparently there was a bad injury as well but there you go. Should we have a quick look at the old uh, standings? Yeah, I mean, uh, something else to note that we only learned yesterday is this this concussion um, substitution. Oh, so yeah, yeah. In the World Cup or in a normal game, you're allowed four substitutions, whereas before it used to be in, in a normal game, it's three. Three. Yeah. So already you've got four substitutions in the game, I guess to do with the heat in that. But if, you, if a player gets taken off uh, due to a concussion injury, the opposing team also gets another additional substitution. Otherwise, they could, would, in effect, would could have five to, to four. So that's mm. something else we learned yesterday as well. So, yeah. uh, if, so that was a strange one. So here we go. Uh, here's, yeah. the, here's the group tables. So, I mean, before it started, you would expect Netherlands to win it. I mean, they yep. pulled out. We haven't, we haven't talked about them, but obviously they beat Senegal yesterday 2-0. Yep. Um, they did struggle a lot in that game, I believe. In Senegal, I think it wasn't. Yeah, they can hold their own. You know, they've got a lot of French-born players, haven't they? In, in that's it. Yeah, Senegal. French Senegal. So, yeah, I get that. Uh, it's going to be tough. I think you know, Senegal can still do it. I think it'll be real tough for Qatar. I'd really do. Um, but yeah, Netherlands should, should qualify after seeing that. And then England's group after game one. What I saw of England, I think they should. They should qualify as long as they play the way they, you know, they can play. Yep. And you know the jury's out on Wales and USA, really. Um, I haven't seen know. enough of USA yet. I mean, you know, from from what we've seen there, they they got some players, they got some pace, which is yeah. always, you know, again that Dangerous. could upset England. England, you know, we we know what we're like at the back if it gets a bit shady. So either one of those two we need to see a bit more of those. See which and one I, comes I like out. the Iranians. Uh, uh, manager who said out of those three games at the World Cup he thought well before the game he thought England were going to be the easiest Carlos so, Quiros yeah, ex, uh, ex Man United um, assistant manager yes he did he did mm. uh, although he still at the same time gave us one of his, as, as his favourites to win it so I'm not I know sure yeah, I, one, I think if he's sort of you know covering all bases so we got Argentina 1 Saudi 2 Mexico Poland <laughs> I asked you about this yesterday you thought Mexico, didn't you? Well, I don't know. It's, I'm not sure, to be honest. Um, I mean, Poland have got Lewandowski. They've got a good, strong... They've got the Tottenham right midfielder. They've got yep. a good, strong team. On their day, they could win that group. They could, they could win the group, especially with Argentina messing about like that to start with. So, I mean, you know, that'll give them a bit more a bit more impetus. I mean, the Mexican team... Uh, I don't Nobody really know the, the no. players at the moment. No, not, no. no real standouts. No so standouts. I used to. I used to know them quite well, but nothing major for me. But we'll see. We'll see. How okay. We get on. And um, then tomorrow, I think we've got. This is all Denmark. Oh, we've already got Tunisia and Denmark who are drawn 0 0. Okay. Um, so. Yep. We've got France and Australia. So France, yeah. Australia, possibly. But you need to Denmark. Denmark. I would have thought D D Denmark would have won that game, so it's interesting. Yeah. Australia, you never rule Australia out. I, I, you know, on their day, they can upset people. I don't think they'll upset France. I think France will just 
I think France will win the group comfortably, to be honest. Comfortably. And then it's between Denmark and Australia there, I think. Um, you know, yeah. Australia, if they get it together, could could have a chance. Not a problem. Progressing. Oh, well, there you go. Um, what else have we got? So, uh, some of the build-up, obviously, to, to the World Cup. But um, one of the things that we, we heard ye- uh, yesterday, I think it was, um, it, it was officially came out that... Uh, Tattoos and body paint are not classed as clothing, and everybody needs to be fully clothed at the uh, 2022 World Cup. So, just in case you were thinking about it, saying what? that your body tattoos. What did it do? What did it do? Is, uh, it came out. Did you say? It came out. You can't be People doing aren't that. Coming out over there. Not Nobody's over there. coming out over there, over mate. There. No. Uh, brilliant. All right. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. All right. Well, there you go. There's a bit of uh, the World Cup for you. Join us again in a couple of days. Make sure you hit the subscribe button. Come with us. Please do. Yep. Um, Um, In the comments, who do you think is going to win the the, the thing outright? Any uh, dark horses? Um, Any any golden boot? Golden boot. Who do you reckon for the golden boot already? Certainly ain't Kane now. Six goals England. He didn't get any. (laughs) Yeah, didn't get any, did he? But uh, maybe maybe the lads will, um, you know, help him out on the next one. But uh, all right, in your comments, Mbappe, who do you yeah. think for the winner? And uh, yeah, top scorer of the of the competition. And who and are you following? Funnies, who are you following? Yeah, who do you follow out there, uh, and why? You know, if it's not your home country, if if um, you pick somebody else, no Italy this year. No, no Italy. They're no. normally good. Yeah, interesting. Uh, mm. All right. Until tomorrow for another reaction. Thanks for joining us today. It's goodbye from me. Uh, it's a goodbye from him over there. On me head, son. All right. <laughs> He's a 20th century boy.